The standard modules that we make with the temporary dockage system are a 10 by 40, like you see behind me, a 10 by 20, and also a 10 by 10 intersection component, which allows you to make 90 degree turns, uh, intersections, L heads, T heads, any number of configurations. What makes the uh, modules so that they're easy to maneuver around, clip together um, for the temporary basis is this non-articulating hinge connection. Non-articulating meaning it receives two pins rather than one, which eliminates the hinging action and gives it a more stable connection point. Um, you'll notice across the end we have a single tab on one side, a double tab on the other, and a limiting device in the center. This allows so whichever direction the modules are placed, they all will connect evenly. Because the docks have to go in quickly, the utilities need to be installed and need to be the utilities need to be uh, removed quickly. We build into the floating dock system these hinged up chase panels. This allows you to lay the utilities down throughout throughout the dock from one end to the other to exit the dock. We have these flip up blocks that allow for the utilities to come up where you can mount a power stanchion for a power center, um, your water hookups, whatever you may need. The uh, temporary modules also have to be very easy to maneuver around. So in these modules, we've built in uh, lifting eyes. To mount something off the sides of the main walkway, such as finger piers, um, requires a special piece of hardware. What we've done is we've designed what we call the universal connection bracket, which is actually just a jaw that clamps down on the whaler, and when the bolt is tightened, it gives you another solid connection point. Once the connection brackets are in place, you can attach finger pairs as seen in this diagram. The universal connection bracket is not just for finger pair connections, it also can be used as a pile guide connection. The universal bracket can also be used for flagpole installation. This is a smaller version of the original universal bracket. This one is designed to receive tent stanchions um, for a red cover. The, tension, the stanchion would actually slide down. These two bolts lock the stanchion in place. Uh, as shown in the uh, photographs following this, 